Good day, good day. How the honk are ya? <laughs> Welcome to Roverland. What up Wednesday? And it's an unboxing with a bag. <laughs> Finally got out to Walmart at the local uh, Toma store. Yeah, thanks to my new girlfriend. <laughs> Shout out to her. She's my new lucky lady now. Yeah, so, uh, what up Wednesday? Because I got something in here that is special, huh? All right, let's check it out. Thanks for joining me today. How the honk are you? I'm great. Boy, I got this, and I just came right over to the studio and filmed this so I could put it out on a Wednesday. What up Wednesday? Here it is. No, that's not it. I just uh, found those as well. And... But bam No, that's not it as well, but I found these too. Yeah, they're coming out. That's the uh, F case there. Yeah, I had uh, tagged uh, not to open the F case ones because I only had one or two. No, only one. So now I got a couple more F case of the Land Rover Velar. But that's not it. What a Wednesday. Are you ready for this? Unbelievable. I got to make sure it's the right one because I bought something else too. Bam! There it is! Ba bam! Yes! In the wild! Toma Walmart, unbelievable! There she is! Search and Rescue Land Rover, number four out of five with the Real Riders, Metal on Metal, Land Rover Defender 110 hardtop. Yeah! Yes, sirree! This is the Hot Wheels Premium. Car culture. Um, this, uh, these retail well here in the, in the Midwest. This was what? Oh, I got the slip. I better I better look at the slip here, so I can tell you exactly what I had to pay. Five forty-seven. Yes, and there are all the cars from this Wild Terrain series of Hot Wheels car culture. Uh, the Unibog. Bronco, Land Rover, the off-road Camaro, which comes over from the, uh, well, so does the Land Rover, but comes over from the Fast and Furious, and the Porsche 959, the 1986. So there's the back of the car. I thought I would, I've been bidding on these on eBay, but anything over $6, I'm just not going to pay quite yet, because they're brand new. And uh, distribution of Hot Wheels is alive and well, but kind of slowed because of the, the COVID-19. But yeah, here it is. Oh, man. All right. Okay, I'll show you what other one I bought. <laughs> just, just to let you know, I do uh, occasionally pick up, uh, occasionally I do pick up some of these. This is an awesome rig, and I had to pick one up. Yep, uh, the uh, 1988 Mercedes Unimog U13. Ot. This is the first one in the series. But anyway, I do, uh, just for uh, safekeeping and whatnot, put those aside so I can uh, just say I have one in case uh, times get tough and we got to sell one. Well, guess what? It's time. Yeah, we're going to do it, folks. Right here on Roverland. First one I've got, bought it in the wild myself. Didn't have to pay an outrageous price on eBay or anything like that. So we are going to open it up and take a look. Now, this is this model, and it is in a different livery. So let's take a look at what we've got. All right. Oh, man. And uh, double-A yellow is my favorite color. Maybe not this quite this shade of yellow, but this is great, grand and glorious. Wowzer. Yeah, I'm speechless. <laughs> I'm just downright speechless. Yep. So we've got front-end tampos on the lights. On the nose, we have the Land Rover on the nose of the hood. Come around to the side. 
Obviously, Defender 110 on the, the uh, quarter panel there. Search and Rescue Land Rover with the yellow center wheels. This is the uh, regular uh, wheels that they, boy, I don't know. I, I am just, this is not focusing at all well for me today. I want, we're so excited, huh? <laughs> uh, same black roof, just a different paint job. Let's take a look at the base here. Thailand should be the same pretty much. Of course, the date code is different. N12. So there we go. There we go. Look at the back here. See what kind of details we have there. 410 on the license plate there. And nice uh, Land Rover Defender over here tail lights all done up no rear tire on there uh, just a regular rear door on that here's the other side mirrors the uh, other side they do put some details on the uh, door handles here and there is a uh, smudge mark of paint for the uh, vent it's got the rear window or rear side side mirrors to it. Very, very nice. No side markers for the uh, turn signals from up front here. But yeah, very, very nice. Very nice. Beautiful. I'm glad I finally found one. I knew I would, and I knew I would share it with you here. And it happens to be a one of Wednesday. Yeah, it was just so exciting. Uh, yeah, I found this on uh, Monday, Monday right before work. Yeah, I uh, just had to, I just stopped in the Toma there. And so there we go. There's the two brothers together. So they're pretty much uh, the same deco and everything as far as the trim package. Now the Fast and the Furious just have FNF, Fast and Furious 110, and I'm not sure what uh, 410 means. Oh, that's not a 4, that's a 110. That's what that is, it, the uh, decal is a little goofed up there, but it's 110, that's what it is. Yeah. Can you see that? So there we go. So that makes sense. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Hello. All right. So yeah. Very, very nice. It is kind of nice. The, the darker, well, black. Um, and I, I, I don't mind black colored cars uh, in real life or in die cast. I don't mind them, but you can't see unless you, uh, you know, shine the reflection on there you can't see any of the details now this one has the uh, silver because you can't paint black on black and get an accent there but you can see it's the same wheel and everything as before just uh, different colors you know they look a little bit different this one uh, they, they are a little bit different this the black one has a little bit bigger holes in the rim than the yellow one and the bead around the lip of the rim on the black one has uh, got holes on it yeah I guess the uh, yellow one does too it's kind of hard to see does maybe have some texture around there but they're virtually the same wheel but yeah they are slightly different interesting 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 and uh, we're going to just take a look at uh, the bases together while we're at it here I'm taking the time and really looking at this model yeah of course let's let's do it uh, right side up Dano yeah you upside down monkey you <laughs> all right so there you go just beautiful beautiful truck same uh, treads on the tires, pretty much. Yup. 
So yeah, so with the lighter colors, um, you can see more of the details, which is very nice, very nice. Um, yeah, wow, just an excellent truck. Well, hopefully you guys have found it. I know a couple of you guys have uh, went to eBay and bought some. Uh, hopefully you didn't pay an arm and a leg, but uh, I think now till the end of the year, uh, Hot Wheels will have a good distribution of their uh, cars. The production is um, hasn't fallen behind. It's just the distribution due to COVID-19. So there it is. What a Wednesday. Yes, that is the Land Rover Defender 110 hardtop. See it first right here on Roverland. <laughs> Yeah, excellent, excellent model. Come on over to Facebook, Roverland, and join it there. And join me on Instagram, on Roverland channel. Well, that's going to do it for a one on Wednesday. A quick look at an awesome car. New release, Search and Rescue. And as always, folks, remember, slow traffic, keep right. And have a great rover day.